Doug versus Tim. Doug versus Tim, baby. D on T. Uh, the, the, <laughs> yeah, keep it in. That's the name of the episode, Emily. D on T. No. The Who Win of the Week this week is Doug Heffernan from King of Queens versus Tim, the Toolman Taylor from Home Improvement. Now, Doug Heffernan can't be beat. By anyone. He's the king of queens, baby. He's never going to be taken down. Honorable He's mention, on the top of the mountain. We should have done Doug from king of, Qu- king of Queens versus Mike from Mike and Molly. Honorable mention. And Mike still would have fucking gotten swept out of the way. Swept under the rug yeah. immediately by Doug Heffernan. No. Can't be beat. Tim, the tool man. Taylor. Yeah. Is a, is a, is a handyman. Mm-hmm. He's got experience with his hands. I'll tell you what, though. The guy, at one point, yes, tool man all the way. But the whole thing about home improvement is, you know, he has the, he has the show, Tool Time. The kid's gone soft. Tim Taylor has gone soft, okay? He's he's a he's a fucking... He's a he's an entertainment. He's too busy making he's like a, He's now. like a... Um, he's like a... Not getting down in the Although, nitty-gritty. you know what? I don't want to say um, celebrity chef because Bobby Flay is a fucking man. That guy can cook. That guy could make this table taste fucking great. But Tim the Toolman Taylor, he's gone celebrity, man. He's sold out. He's soft. Doug Heffernan. Matthew, Doug, Doug Heffernan. I mean... You're going to walk a beat downtown. The but, captain. You're going to walk a beat downtown. The guy just can't be beat name that movie uh the other guys thank you doug heffernan is i mean for one uh he's got the build he does have a a build not the build no he he's a got build. The, he's got the build brother he's got the build <laughs> no you gotta do him dude it's doug heffernan all the way man it's not even close he's he's lifting those packages every day dude he gets bossed around by his wife who's fucking hot as shit and also yeah she nags him a lot she nags him a lot runs his show no she doesn't run his dad runs his show that's her dad her also, dad runs his not show. Not running the show. Not running the show. Is that Matthew. George Costanza's dad too? Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. big Jerry time Stiller, runs his show. Oh, and I'll tell you what, Frank Costanza, one of the best TV characters of all times. Um, fuck, what's his name? What's his name in on uh, King of Queens? I'm t- You're the only person ever watched it. Arthur Spooner yeah, is his name Arthur on King Spooner. of Queens. That Matthew, right. Arthur Spooner is because he's in that show, you know, so much more than he was in Seinfeld. And when Jerry Stiller gets his chance to fucking spread his wings dude he flies he soars man yeah. he doesn't fly he soars he is so funny on that show i mean there's a there's a moment where they're like uh using a computer and it's got like voice to text and they show him he comes in he's like dad check out this new program it hears what you're saying and it types it and he goes oh really and he goes into the mic and goes bosoms <laughs> hilarious <laughs> And then there's this one where um, they're having a they're having a cookout, and uh, this kid draws a, a picture of of him, and you know it's a kid's pr- picture. It looks fucking terrible. It's all just crayon or whatever. So the kid's like, "Mr. Spooner, I made a, a a drawing for you." And he goes, "Oh, for me." And he looks at it and he sees it's just like a stick figure with a big head. And he goes. Don't quit your day job, Picasso! <laughs> he yells at this kid, and it's so funny, man. But we're not talking about yeah, no, Arthur. We're, not talking we're about talking Arthur about Spooner. Doug. We're talking about Doug Heffernan, the man, the myth, the one who's going to win this fight. He can't be beat, especially dude, by a softy like He Tim. is. No, because Doug is legitimately soft. Like, dude, he's soft. He is soft. He's a walking Viagra commercial, Matthew. How dare you say that? <laughs> no. How dare you say that? No. Tim no. the Toolman Taylor is E D personified. No. Yes. I, I think yes, it's the is. exact opposite. I think it's the exact opposite. He is deflated by his job all the time. He's a miserable guy. Doug is a miserable guy? Yeah. Matthew, he's, he's always doing complaining. What, he's doing what he has to do to survive, man. He's a blue collar guy, okay? Mm-hmm. He's putting in the time. See, he the, the problem is he's working a blue collar job, I guess you could say, but he's not a blue collar guy. What he's the got God damn blue hell collar are you talking about? about. Well, Tim the Tool Man Taylor is a fake blue collar no, guy. Oh, dude, he's a he's a phony. He went through the he's ranks, dude. He he's went through the ranks. Doug's still walking to beat downtown. Tim the Tool Man is fucking the, the so a sellout. He's no, a sellout. He's the fucking uh, uh chief. 
He's the chief of police, and Doug's walking to beat downtown. He's the chief He's of sucking in my nuts, brother. I'll tell you that right now. I'll tell you that for free. He's got nothing on Doug. No matter what job Doug, no matter what job Doug has. He's put he's putting the work in, he's putting the time in. That's good. That's good. Doug, I mean Doug, Doug takes it. He's and honestly Yeah, Doug does take it in the ass, buddy. Shut yeah, the fuck right back up. Yeah, shut the fuck Doug, up. Doug is soft, Andy. No, he's not, yes. Matthew. He walks a beat no, downtown. He you when he's when he's <laughs> when he's at home, he's trying to relax because he's working so hard de- delivering these fucking packages all the time. And you know what? Here's the thing, man. Yes, his wife is nagging him all the time, but Doug's still doing what Doug wants to do. That's the whole fucking point of the show. The Doug, That's the whole fucking point of the show, kid. Is that Doug's wife what goes, he do don't do this wants thing? To do. Doug goes. Doug's, wa- I've Doug's never wife seen, goes, Doug, I've never seen Doug go out and then for Doug a beer. Goes, okay. Doug's never gone okay, out for a beer. Okay, then you haven't beer. watched the show. Then you <laughs> haven't watched the show. <laughs> then you haven't seen it. All right, Jerry And also, he, dr- he, he, he drinks a lot of beer at home also, FYI. Wait, I really, I haven't watched King of Queens in a really long time. It's so good. One of the be- most underrated sitcom theme song of all time. Yeah, you, you've sang weary. it before. And I'll sing it again, baby, because it's a fucking classic. My back is getting tight. I'm sitting here in traffic on the Queen's Road Bridge tonight. But I don't care because all I want to do is cash my check and drive right home to you. See, again, so I'm not done, baby. All my life I will be driving home to you. You just flung water on me and squished my pinky. I do apologize for that. That was uncalled for. Now... The theme no, song. Matthew, what's the what's the Tim? What's the Tim? Uh, what's Tool Tool Times theme song? <laughs> it's some shit like that. I swear to God, yeah, that's pretty I like much that. what it is. I like it's fucking that. dumb. No, Andy. and Matthew, think about uh, uh, you're calling you're calling Doug Soft based on the theme song. What is that theme song? It's a it's it's a ballad of this man who's working to provide for his family, and of course he'd rather be spending time with them. But because they're the most important thing in his life, Matthew. He's willing to break his back for them every see, day, day in see, and day out. Tim the Toolman Taylor is trying to get away from his family. No. He's yeah, not exactly. Family. That, Tim the Toolman Taylor is a real man. He wants to lock himself in his garage and not talk to his wife. That's what that's what men in America used to do, Andy. That's what men in America used to do. They used to hide from their wives and children. Mm-hmm. Some of them hid. Some of them are still hiding. <laughs> yeah. Some of them are still Some hiding. Some of them have well. to be found. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But brother, it's Doug Heffernan all the way. Uh, I, I mean, he's slamming Tim the Toolman to the ground. He's toast. Dude. He's gonna he's... throw one punch. He's gonna be like, ah, broke my hand. Tim's got fucking rock fists, baby. He's got hard hands. You gotta he's rewatch. He's been working with those puppies his whole life. Excuse me. You gotta rewatch these shows because you are off base. You are off base, my friend. See, here's the thing, Andy. Is I couldn't tell you a single thing about either of them. This is all based off of. How I perceive these two people. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. I hear you. And your perception is correct. Is incorrect. No. Yeah. That's not is. how perception works. Why do you do yeah. this? Because you just. <laughs> I never get you and I got you. So mm-hmm. I'm counting that as a win. Well, let's lock it in, dude, because yeah. I, it is what it is. Clean sweep, 2 0. No, no, Doug. it's Doug. It's Doug, Matthew. And also, I want to say this. And you know what? I might even include this in the Instagram clip, which I never do, but I might for this one. If you pick Tim the Toolman Taylor in the poll, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> it's a split, folks, apparently. <laughs> I thought this one was obvious, but uh, it, we're going to split You're, down right, the you're right about that. You are right about that. Tim the Tool Time Taylor versus Doug. Fucking You know his name. You dirty yeah. you dirty, Ham- dirty Doug Hemroid, Doug uh, Yeah, Doug Hemroid's his yeah, name. Doug, uh, Fuck you. <laughs> What's his last name? Heffernan. Doug, Doug Heffernan. Heffernan. Yeah. Doug Fat. Doug yeah, Fat, Doug, I think is his name. Doug Heffernan. Um Vote on Doug that on fat. Friday on Instagram. Who would win of the week?